Uh, this is Dr. Teal's foaming bath. This, this has Epsom salt in it, and it also is the rose essential oil scent. So it, it creates calm and serenity. And I'm just using the kitchen sink right now, so I'll just use this so you can see what it looks like, what it would look like in a bathtub. So it does smell like roses. I'm just going to pour some in here. So the directions for here is to pour a generous amount of Dr. Teal's Calm and Serenity Foaming Bath under warm water, running water for a relaxing bubble bath. So you can see with one cap that it made bubbles with just one cap. So just imagine in the tub, you probably want to use a little bit more. But it does have a nice smell to it. You know, you do smell that rose essential oil. So if you like roses, this would be something that, if you like roses, this would be something that you would probably want to try. You know, it creates that, it really does smell good. I mean, it smells, it smells really nice. It has a real, it has a real nice scent to it. You can tell it makes it makes some bubbles, so it smells good. I like it. It smells really good. So if, if you like something, you know, like roses, then this would be something that you can try. And you put it right in your bath. It's a foaming bath, and it does have pure Epsom salt to help you relax. All right. So it does have. It says. Let me just show you what it says on the bottle. It says it has long-lasting bubbles. Long lasting bubbles gently cleanse. Okay, so looks like the bubbles will last a long time. And you can see in here, just with one cap, just with one cap of this product, um, how well it has done just with the bubbles. I'm not sure how long they'll stay in there, but it, it does seem to be at lasting. Some bubbles, you know, do fade away pretty quickly, but this one does uh, a pretty good job. Again, this is Dr. Teal's foaming bath, and this one is with. Rose Essential Oil.